Hey guys, so um, today's been a very relaxing day for the most part. Um, my friend Grace came over and was here for about an hour. Instead of meeting at Pete's, we meted, we meted, we met, we met here at my house because um, can't really go anywhere, or do anything at this moment. Well, I can now. Um, now that I got the. Uh, Holy catheter taken out this afternoon um, but up until then I was pretty much couch bound um, still can't do a whole lot my ribs are still broken um, but with time they'll heal so I'm not too concerned about that um, <coughs> 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 coughing hurts a lot. I'm not really fond of coughing right now. So, um, so a few days ago I made the video, I think the day actually I went to the hospital, I made the video of, um, what I'm talking about tonight. I do actually get to go to church and give my story. It's a short part of my story, but it's still part of my story. So, I'm very excited. It's about friends and courage and how friends have given me courage and what friends have given me courage and when they've given me courage. Um, probably tomorrow I'll put the video up of me reading my story. I just didn't want to put it up ahead of time and have anybody actually come across it um, before it was time. So, um, yeah. So I'm probably going to go get in the shower and start getting ready for that. It's not till 7 o'clock tonight. And it's almost 5 o'clock. Is it almost 5 o'clock? Yeah. Uh, 4.41. Um, and I'm still moving pretty slow. Um, and I've got clothes in the wash. So um, before I know it, it will be like 6.30 and I'll be leaving and having to go. So... Um, yeah, I just am so thankful to be home from the hospital and um, feeling better, not 100% yet. I don't know if I told you guys that they said um, the other day when I was gardening and I did it for like five hours straight, that probably did my body in, when was last Tuesday, I guess, um, it, my body didn't handle it so I can garden for an hour well I can't garden at all right now I'm gonna have to get somebody who knows how to garden to come help me because I have some plants that really need to go get taken care of actually let's see if I can show you hang on a second I'm gonna attempt to get up here Ooh, a little painful okay I don't mean to be braggy but I feel like when I look at myself in the camera, I feel like I've lost some weight. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, it is a beautiful day out today. I look like crap today. Whoa, it's like really sunny. Okay, so um, my plants are looking amazing. Okay, so that is the um, squash and cucumber. My little eggshells. Um, have carrots and beans in them, I think. My Brussels, <laughs> Brussels sprouts, my basil, and then that would be asparagus, my strawberries, the flowers that need some. Okay, this is really cool, guys. I have to show you. So, this, oh, ow, this really hurts. Ow, ow, ow. This right here. I don't know if you can tell, but it's celery. So it was like a celery stalk, and I just cut it and put it in some dirt, and that's what's coming of it. So yeah, so there's my mint, my peppers, tomatoes, tomatoes. Okay, so you see that one right there, the yellow one? I took some kale off my kale plant in the kitchen and tried to replant it. Apparently it didn't work. That is the da, 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 rosemary. So, tomato, 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 tomato. 
But I'm so excited about these guys. Look, they're so cute. So, um, yeah. Oh, and then there's some strawberries over here that are going to need to get moved because they're not in enough sun. I also just wanted to show you the ones that are here in the house. Um, my kale is like taken off. It's huge. It's kind of crazy. So, oh, okay, sorry about the lighting. This would be my cilantro. Oops, okay, there's the camera. See? Cilantro. Um, hang on a second, I'm trying to figure out how to hold this and make it work at the same time with the lighting being the way it is. Okay. Sorry. Whoa, crap. Ah, I just made a mess. That would be the lemon thyme that I just built water all over the floor from. Great. Um, okay, so we're just going to do it this way since you can see it. So, lemon thyme, basil, oregano, sage, and at the end in the yellow is the kale. But do you see how crazy huge that is right now? Um, oh my gosh, I totally just made a huge mess. Look at that. That is like gorgeously huge. Like, I'm pretty proud of myself for that. Okay, so anyways, I don't know how I'm gonna clean that mess up. Oops. Cause I can't really bend over and clean it up. So. Uh, maybe I should just go get in the shower and say I don't know how it happened, but it happened <laughs> So anyways talk to you guys later Hey guys, so just got in the car getting ready to head over to church to go do my thing um, I'm a little nervous um, Not really of speaking in front of people, but just being around people right now since it's only been 24 hours that I've been out um, hence the mask. It like filters the air, whatnot. Uh, Vog masks. I love it. Um, so yeah, well, I'll probably take it off when I do my talk, but just getting in and being around there, I will have it on. So here we go.